Join Louise Hay and learn to overcome fears and create a feeling of safety for you and your world. I'm Victoria Johnson, teacher, trainer, and coach trainer for the Heal Your Life Certification Training Programs. For more information, please visit thetraining.ca. That's T-H-E training dot C-A. Hello, this is Louise Hay, and I would like to explore some ideas with you and share some affirmations about moving through fears in ways that are empowering to you. Doing affirmations, that is, repeating positive statements, is a way to erase old negative messages. In the dark of the night, we hear sounds, and we are afraid of the unknown. In the dark of our minds, we think scary thoughts, and we become afraid. We replay long gone childhood terrors and we cringe. We hear the sounds of our parents' fearful voices warning us of dangers real and imagined. The world tells us to be afraid, that life is unsafe, and we, the obedient children, listen and believe and tremble. We learn to see a fearful world and we learn to believe that the world is a fearful place. As we believe, so we experience. We, in our minds, create the fear and then we keep it going by the experiences we have that mirror our fears. And yet it is all only thoughts that we are talking about. And thoughts can be changed. The thoughts we think, the ideas we believe, create our experiences. Fearful thoughts create fearful experiences. Yes, it may be true that your childhood was a fearful place to be. You may have been terrorized at that time. You may, even today, have fear in your life. But do you want to continue to live that way? Or would you like to now create a world for yourself that is safe and peaceful and secure? You can join me in changing your thoughts from fear to safety. It's worked for me, and I'm sure it can work for you. Let's begin by taking a deep breath. And as you exhale, let the fear out. Imagine that every time you exhale now, you are releasing old fears, some a little at a time, and some all at once in a big, big exhale. Now affirm and declare with me. I release and I let go. I let go of fears old and new. There is no longer any need for me to scare myself I forgive all those who have ever hurt me. I forgive myself for hurting others. I forgive myself for blaming and punishing myself. I forgive my parents for their fears and limitations. And I now declare for myself that I am safe. I sleep and wake and move in complete safety. Each person creates their own reality. I now create a reality for myself of oneness and security. 
I create an island of safety around me. I can see this island in my mind's eye. It is safe and serene. It is beautiful and green. I walk freely everywhere on this island in perfect peace. This island becomes my world. And everyone on this island enjoys this same safety. We are all peaceful. Everyone in my world is peaceful. I am safe. I am secure. I am at peace. Every corner of my world is a safe place. I am safe in the daytime. I am safe at night. I walk in peace. My inner intelligence always leads me into peaceful byways. My bed is a safe place. I release the day with love and I embrace sleep. I am safe when I am asleep. I am safe during the night. My dreams are dreams of joy. I awaken feeling safe and secure. I enter the new day with joyous anticipation, for it is a day that has never been lived before. I know and affirm that I am safe in this new day. I am always safe in my home, and all who enter my home do so in safety and peace. My food is safe and healthful and nourishing. Every room in my dwelling place is safe and peaceful. My home is a peaceful shelter. I am relaxed at home. I radiate love wherever I am. I surround myself with loving people. Only love goes out from me, and only love comes back to me. I forgive others and move on. I am forgiven, and I am free. All forms of transportation I use are safe. I am safe in cars and buses, in trains and planes, even on bicycles and skateboards. No matter what form of transportation I use, I am safe and secure. I am able to relax when traveling. I am a peaceful traveler. I know I am safe at work. I work in a place that is harmonious. I love the work that I do. I am safe with my co-workers. I am safe with my boss. My job is safe and mine as long as I want it. I am relaxed and peaceful when I am working. Even when working to a deadline, I feel peaceful. And the more peaceful I am, the more efficient I am. I do my best work when I relax. I create a relaxed, joyful atmosphere wherever I am. My boss appreciates me and loves the way I work. I am calm and secure at all times. Wherever I go in this world, I take my island of safety with me. This island of safety 
also protects my family. Every member of my family is safe and protected. I release all worries about my family. I surround each member of my family with thoughts of safety and peace. From the smallest to the largest, from the youngest to the oldest, from home to school to work to play and home again. Each one is moving through life in peace and harmony. I free my family to be who they are and to live life in their own way, knowing that no harm can befall them. My family also allows me to be who I am and to live my life in the way I think is best. We are all safe and free. I relax in this knowledge and I am at peace. I feel safe and secure in my spiritual beliefs. I feel at one with my Creator. I know my Creator has only my joy and my well-being in mind. I trust in the power that created me to protect me at all times and under all circumstances. I was created to be all that I can be. I am safe with life. All my lessons are easily learned. I easily release that which no longer works. It is safe for me to learn. I approach new lessons with joyous anticipation. It is easy for me to learn. I am willing to learn. I love to learn new things. I am relaxed while studying. Studying is a joy. I soak up new information like a sponge. Life gives me easy lessons. I am harmless to others, and others are harmless to me. I feel safe with the young and with the old. I feel safe with those who are like me and those who are different from me. I feel safe with animals. I am relaxed with animals. I live in harmony with all animals. The weather is my friend. I am in harmony with all of life. The sun, the moon, the wind, the rain, the earth, and the movement of the earth. I am at peace with the elements. I am always comfortable in any weather. My body adjusts to the outer temperature, and I am at ease. The dark is my friend. The dark is comforting to me. I move through the dark with ease. I am safe in the dark. There is nothing in the dark for me to fear. I am always safe and well protected. I feel safe in my body. I am healthy and safe and secure. Old beliefs in dis-ease and pain and suffering are now released. I now choose to be healthy. And I now radiate vibrant health. 
I take loving care of my body, and my body loves me. Food is my friend. Exercise is my friend. I am safe when exercising. I enjoy the feeling of exercise. My body loves to be stretched and exercised. And I choose exercise that is a joy. I have also learned to be tranquil. In the midst of chaos, I can be tranquil. Tranquility is inner peace. I practice being peaceful when others are agitated. I do not have to buy into other people's agitation. For me, peace of mind and loving myself is the most important state I can experience. Relationships are safe for me. All of my relationships are loving. It is safe for me. To be open and honest in a relationship, and I allow others to be open and honest with me. It is safe for me to love. It is safe for me to take care of myself in a relationship, and it is safe for me to be myself with others. It is safe. For me to learn and grow, I am willing to change. I am willing to become more of who I am. It is safe for me to be all that I can be. I threaten no one when I am myself, and all my relationships support me in my growth. I am safe with my friends. I am safe with my acquaintances. I am safe with the public, and I am even safe with so-called enemies. I now attract only loving people into my life. I am safe at every age. It is safe for me to be young. And it is safe for me to grow old. I look forward to living a long and healthy life. Every age holds its own joys and treasures, and I will enjoy my life to its last minute and beyond. And when I leave this world, I know I will be safe. In my next new adventure, when it is time to make my transition, I will pass from this life in peace and harmony at the time that is perfect for me. Death is a natural experience, and I am safe. Life gives me all of my experiences. At the perfect time, I am in harmony with this process called life. And even though sometimes I do not understand why certain things happen, I am willing to see beyond it and know that life is always unfolding for my highest good. I no longer choose to scare myself with my own thoughts. I love myself too much to frighten myself ever again. By changing my thoughts, I now create peace in my world. Peace replaces fear. Terror. Is replaced with tranquility. Scariness becomes serenity. 
uncertainty becomes confidence. Love replaces hate and repression makes way for freedom. I bless all people with love. I surround the planet with love. I know we are safe. All is well. And so it is. I love you.
Now I would like to lead you through my meditation for creating a safe and loving world. Think of today and every day as a day of learning, a new beginning, an opportunity to change and grow, to open your consciousness to a new level, to consider new ideas and new ways of thinking, to love our inner children, to envision the world that we dream of living in. Our vision helps to create our world. Come with me as we see ourselves, our world, and our planet in new and powerful ways. Let's begin with the inner child. See your own inner child. Notice how your little child looks and feels. Comfort your child. You might apologize to your little one for having neglected it for so long or having only berated it and scolded it in the past. But now you can promise your inner child that from now on you will always be there for it. You will never leave it again. And whenever this child wants your comfort or advice or playtime with you, you will always be there. You acknowledge that this relationship with your inner child is one of the most important in your life. Tell your child how much you treasure it. Build its self-esteem and self-worth with praise. See your child relax, safe, peaceful, enjoying itself, laughing, happy, playing with friends, running free, enjoying everything it does, school, studying, being creative, sharing with others, touching a flower, hugging a tree, picking a piece of fruit, eating it with delight, playing with a puppy or a kitten, Swinging in a swing, high above, laughing with joy, running up to you and giving you a big hug. See the two of you, healthy, living in a beautiful and safe place, having wonderful relationships, parents, friends, co-workers, being greeted with joy wherever you go, each having a special kind of love with a special person. Now visualize the teenager within you. Be comforting, as it moves through the bewildering time of puberty that marks the transition from childhood to adulthood. Build its self-esteem and self-worth with words of praise. 
Visualize the adult you are now with love and congratulate yourself for having come this far. You were always doing the best you could at any given point in time and space. Build your own self-esteem and self-worth. The love and acceptance you have for yourself now will make it easy to move to the next level of self-love. You are very powerful. You have the power within you to help create the kind of world you want all of us to live in. You have the power of your mind and thoughts. You are very powerful. Gather your inner child, your teenager, and your adult. And together, you can accomplish anything. Let's create a wonderful world together for all of us. Consider now, where do you want to work? What do you want to do? What fulfills you creatively? Where and how do you want to live? See your ideal environment Envision a world that is a great place to live, where everyone has dignity, where everyone, no matter what race or nationality, feels empowered and secure. See children everywhere being treasured and taught that they are valued people. As all child abuse disappears back into the nothingness from whence it came. See schools using their precious time to teach children important things like how to love themselves how to think and use their minds, how to have relationships, how to be parents, how to handle money and be secure financially. Then see all the sick being made well again, dis-ease, becoming a thing of the past as doctors learn to keep people healthy and vital. Pain and suffering dissolving and disappearing. See hospitals being turned into apartment buildings. Let's see all the homeless being taken care of and jobs available for everyone who wants to work. See prisons teaching the benefits of loving the self and building self-worth and self-esteem in guards and prisoners alike and releasing responsible citizens who love life. See churches removing sin and guilt from their teachings and supporting their members in expressing their divine magnificence and finding their highest good. See governments really caring about people 
with justice and mercy available to everyone. See honesty and fairness returning to all businesses as greed becomes unknown. See men and women empowering each other to live in dignity as all acts of violence are eliminated. See pure water and nourishing food and clean air being the norm for all of us. Now let's walk outside and feel the clean rain. And as it stops and the clouds fade away, see a beautiful rainbow as the sun comes out. Notice the clear air. Smell its freshness. See sparkling water in streams and lakes. And notice the lush vegetation. Forests filled with trees flowers and fruits and vegetables abundant and available to everyone. In other countries, we could see everyone enjoying peace and plenty. There is harmony between all peoples. As we lay down our arms, and open our arms and our hearts. See judgment, criticism, and prejudice becoming old-fashioned and fading away. See borders crumbling, separation disappearing. See us all becoming one truly brothers and sisters who care about each other. Famine becomes intolerable and suffering of all kinds eliminated. From birth to death, let us all live in harmony and dignity. See the planet, our Mother Earth, healed and whole, natural disasters dissipating as the earth breathes a sigh of relief and peace reigns. Now what other positive things would you like to see happening on this planet? You and I are helping to create this new world now just by using our minds to envision. As we continue to hold these ideas in our minds, we contribute to creating the world we deserve to have. You are powerful. You are important. You do count. Treasure your child, your teenager, and your adult. Treasure yourself. Live your vision. Go forth and do what you can to make this all come true for you, for your inner child, for everyone on the planet. Peace and harmony safety and security, health and wholeness, abundance and plenty, all good for all people, 
always, now and forevermore. And so it is. God bless us all.